Hi everybody, Tile at Interfidelity here. Today we're going to talk about the equipment I use to measure headphones. I'm going to give you a brief rundown and then we'll take a closer look. <clears throat> this is the Audio Precision System 2 Cascade. This is the device that generates the signals uh, that I use to test the headphones and analyzes the return from uh, the head acoustics head. Here's the head acoustics head inside the test chamber. Uh, inside the test chamber is also a speaker in the back. You can't see it there, but it was in the photo above. Um, signals from the audio precision tester go through uh, the headroom headphone amplifier here, uh, come to the through the wall of the chamber to the headphone cable here, into the headphones, out of the headphones into the head here, to the microphones in the ear canals. From the microphone in the ear canals, it goes to this uh, pre-amplifier and uh, phantom power supply for the microphones in the head. From the pre-amplifier, it goes to the analyzer section of the audio precision tester. Uh, the audio precision tester is run from uh, this computer here. It's just a very simple PC. Uh, it has audio precision software on it that uh, allows me to control the tester. Of course, the display down here for the computer. So, let's take a closer look. This is the audio precision tester. Uh, front panel. Uh, this, this is the generator side. And this is the analyzer side. The top section is the analog outputs of the tester. It has both balanced outputs and single-ended outputs. On, our, on actually on BNCs. Um, uh, underneath the analog section here is the digital section and it has uh, ASEBU digital outputs um, and also on uh, BNC coax connectors. Uh, in the middle here we have a little fan and on this side is the analyzer uh, section. Uh, left and right inputs um, both balanced and unbalanced. Uh, and underneath the analyzer section here is a monitor section. This is where the output goes to the oscilloscope so that I can monitor what's happening uh, in the head. I love this piece of gear. This is the Head Acoustics HMS2 Mark III uh, Head Acoustics Simulator has all the characteristics that you or I have, uh, at least on average, for the average human being. Uh, in terms of its uh, response to acoustic signals in the free field, and um, produces uh, a signal at the eardrum or at the microphones in the ear of this device that is the same or very nearly the same as uh, the average human. Um, if I take the headphones off here, you can see its ears. Uh, these are pliable and mimic the acoustic absorption of the human ear. The shape of the ear is very, very carefully defined and uh, uh, many, many people had their ears measured in order to produce the average shape of the ear. Uh, it's screwed to the head and underneath this pad is a uh, coupler that mimics the acoustic impedances of your ear canal and then the diaphragm of the microphone which is precisely tuned to have the uh, absorption and reflective characteristics of the normal human eardrum. Uh, there are a number of ears that are available for this. Uh, there are special telephony measurement ears and a variety of things. The other versions of this head are available uh, with uh, a mouth output so it could actually produce uh, sounds um, that a, a person would make. Because it's uh, essentially exactly like our listening system, it allows me to measure all types of headphones. I can use regular full-size headphones on this, super oral headphones, uh, earbud headphones, in-ear monitor headphones. They're all measured on the same head, which means that all the uh, the data that is produced while measuring headphones um, is comparable uh, because it's all 
uh, produced on the same device. You'll notice uh, around the ear there are marks that allow me to know exactly where the center of the ear canal is so that when I position the headphones coarsely I can see that the driver is positioned to at least roughly positioned uh, to a position uh, that you would normally wear the headphones. Thanks for following along today and we'll see you soon.